Hey everyone, welcome. In this video, I'm gonna make Prince Sim digitally inside of Marvelous Designer. So there are different kinds of Prince Sims out there, but mainly these two. One goes to the solder seam and another to the armhole. Well, and that is how it looks in real life. So I'm gonna mimic that and I'm gonna make it in Marvelous Designer. So let's start. Well, in this video, I'm gonna make this kind of Prince Sim. All right. To make it, you should have to have a basic shape. So this is the basic shape. And if you don't have or if you can make it, watch this video or download this from the description. First, I'm going to mimic this line. So, so I'm going to make a line from this to this with the tail line, of course. And then I'm going to see here and I'm going to turn on this. So internal line tool and I'm going to curve it because this is the apex. So this should be a little bit curvier in the in the 2D window. So it will look straight, relatively straight in the 3D window. So like this, you can also see here. And I'm going to like this, right click and cut and sew. So they are now divided. And now I'm going to select this line and this line, right click, offset as internal line, and maybe six. All right. I'm going to select this four, make sure these four lines are selected, trace tool, right click, trace as a pattern, and kind of same thing with here. And then I'm going to delete this red internal line, and I'm going to sew it like this. And I'm going to select this tool in the 3D window, right click, super post under. So they should be underneath and i'm gonna hide this and i'm gonna select this two and control d to symmetric paste and super superimpose under here all right but i'm gonna delete this sewing make sure this is this sewing you are deleting and i'm gonna delete this sewing like this and then i'm gonna see me away so yeah it might cause a little bit problem but all you have to do is click those in like right i think you already see a line here now to make it prominent i'm gonna select this two make sure this two are selected right click into a line and i'm gonna Make the distance of one millimeter and number of upset two or three it, it doesn't matter but two is okay and then when i simulate you can see a prominent line here like this so, so yeah this is that easy so this is the technique i discovered somehow previously what i used to do was just selecting every line and then layer clone under the entire pattern and that it's really costly in terms of computer power so yeah this is that's it. That's how you can make a nice looking the same inside of Glow 3D or Marvelous Designer. If you can make this, you can also make this one. This is very simple. It, it just goes from this to this armhole and just the same technique. And I'm not going to show you because this is unnecessary. So yeah, if you like this quick tutorial, like this video and I will see you the next week. Bye.